In one community in Queens, some people are afraid to walk outside. It's not because of a rise in crime or a spike in COVID cases. It's because of squirrels, of all things, that are attacking residents. Eyewitness News reporter Kimberly Richardson has the story from Regal Park. It was so fast and he had his claws out. He hung on there. He, it's not like he was jumping and jumping away. He was there. Ah! They bit me or scratched me on, on my neck and then I must have like reached over or do something. And next thing I know, it's an MMA cage match and I'm losing. The biting and clawing, her hands were covered with blood, black and blue. As a precaution, she got a rabies shot. Ah! Before we start with this video, I want to introduce you the snowflake of the week. This guy has some kind of intellectual problem. He's watching my videos knowing he can't understand the purpose of pest control. And now we're offering nationwide shipping for those who are interested to eat the squirrels. I will put them on ice for you. Keep in mind what you're about to see is a pest control video. If you can handle that, our last president have something to say. We have thousands of people, and you'll read about him tomorrow. All right, yeah, get him the hell out of here, will you please? Get him out of here. Throw him out. Welcome to Flying Pellets. In this episode, we have Houston, Squirrel Down. All squirrels here where taking care of the most humane way is possible. We don't use poison which affects the nerve system and the squirrels suffer for a few days before it dies. And trapping is not an effective method. You're moving the problem from point one to point two and we will never control the population. Also is a huge possibility that squirrels dies from starvation before find some food. We're using here hollow point pellets, 20 to caliber to ensure the damage at the impact. But these pellets are not super accurate, and once in a while, the shot placement is not the best. But still going through the vitals, taking down the squirrels. From now on, I'll be using the 30 caliber, which is super effective on squirrels at lower feet per second. 40 for grain. JSB Hades flying at 730 feet per second are creating huge damage downrange, ensuring less suffering is possible in the most humane way. If you're wondering of what I do with the meat, I clean the squirrels and take the meat to an animal shelter. And we have a few feral cats around the neighborhood, so I feed them with a tasty squirrel. So, nothing goes to waste. That first pellet hit him so hard, he didn't know what happened to him. That pellet exit were exactly by the butthole. And the second pellet destroy his belly vitals. That's it for today. Don't forget to subscribe. Only subscribers will have a chance to qualify for our future giveaways.